finally in number five you got to believe there's nothing impossible to God you got to believe nothing is impossible to God scientists say or scientists say we use less than 10 percent of our brain you know why because we have such low self-image and self-esteem we think we can't amount to anything much so it's a vicious cycle the, the more lousy we feel about ourselves the more we won't use our brain most of us struggle thinking we're never good enough mark 9 23 jesus said to him if you can believe all things are possible to him who believes some things no a few things no all things are possible if you can just believe so we got to believe our god is all powerful that god has given us visions and dreams your visions and dreams are not games that you play your visions and dreams will carry you into your destiny 24 years ago god gave us a dream God gave us a dream to build a church with a strong atmosphere of faith and purity where every member is released into ministry, disciple in the great commandment of loving God, loving people. In order for us to fulfill and obey the great com commission and the cultural mandate. We believe in that. We have a great mission. By the year 2000, we have grown our church to 10,000 members. Against all odds, we built an underground sanctuary at Churong West. A great feat almost 13 years ago. God gave us a vision to reach out to the broken, to reach out to the wounded, the marginalized, the needy. And then after we have done that, He gave us a vision to impact the marketplace. By the year 2002, you know, we dream of the crossover project using pop culture as a means to communicate the gospel to the youth of Asia and then around the world. For eight years, I traveled 120 times around the globe. And today we have churches and Bible schools everywhere, all throughout Asia into the West. And then we have a vision of an arena in the marketplace for the marketplace to penetrate the marketplace and God gave us Suntech Convention Center for the glory of God hey I can't hear you if you're happy and you know it come on clap your hands and praise God who are we to do all these things we are just ordinary people and we did it when we are very young but we happen to believe that all things are possible to him and to her and to the church who believes. The truth is we are able to do so much in 24 years because 2,000 years ago, he has already done it all for us. Everything was done. Everything was completed. Every sermon I preach, Jesus already prepared for me 2,000 years ago. We just need to keep believing and keep believing and keep believing and never stop believing and believe more and more and believe stronger and believe greater and just keep believing and keep believing and that's the work we have to do